Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. I, Ami Haris Han, the CEO of Baker's Bread, will be presenting the business proposal for the opening of a new branch of Baker's Bread. The new branch of Baker's Bread will be a retail bakery located on the walkway of Ibn Sina Building at CFS IIUM Gambang. Like any other startup bakery, we wish to have a very long-term presence in the bread market. Along with the 10,000 ringgit investment by the amazing Datin Farahana, Baker's Bread hopes to secure a startup financing through the combination of investments and debts to establish the bakery. Baker's Bread will be offering various types of breads and buns, including rolls, croissants, breadsticks, bagels, of different fittings and toppings for the customers to choose from. The organizing committee of Baker's Bread consists of a chief executive manager, a financial manager, a production manager, and an operation manager. It is hoped that we can achieve the objectives of Baker's Bread, which is to provide the best quality bakery services at a reasonable price, establish a delivery system service for those who need it, and also satisfy our customers with our freshly baked breads and buns using our special baking techniques, which has been a secret strength of our business. It is hoped that we can incur the investment of 10,000 ringgit from Datin Farahana, cover the, some of the initial inventory and other expenses for the first three months. We will also be using some of the earnings from our previous business as a personal fund to be invested in the new business. Baker's Bread consists of four amazing partners where we, are, where we have all agreed to invest the same amount of money, which is 5,000 ringgit into the new business. We hope to strive to increase the branding of Baker's Bread during the first year of its operation and maintain a good product quality consistency. The target market of Baker's Bread are the staffs that works near the Ibn Sina building, the visitors, and lastly, students and lecturers, as they are the largest contributor of the population of the CFS IIUM community. Next, I will be inviting Faris, my trusted operation manager, to continue the presentation. Thank you, Brother Amir, for the nice uh, explanation on what we are going to do with the 10,000 ringgit funds if we get it from Datin Farah, from our funder. And right now, me, Muhammad Faris Shahmi, who holds the position as operation manager of the Baker's Bakery for almost two and a half year in Kuala Lumpur. I'm going to explain the implicit cost and the explicit cost for our bakeries monthly. So the first one is the implicit cost. For the chief executive manager, the salary given is 5,000 ringgit. For the financial manager, production manager, and operation manager, the salary givens are 2,500 ringgit. And for the branch manager, the salary given is 1,500 ringgit. And to sum up, the total cost is 16,500 ringgit. Next, the explicit cost. For the ingredients, the cost is up to 5,250 ringgit. And the ingredients are consist of 25 kilograms of flour, 24 kilograms of sugar, 60 packets of yeast, 150 grams of bread softener, 250 grams of bread shortening, 500 grams of milk powder, 
butter and margarine and a tray of great A eggs. <laughs> so these ingredients are the basic uh, ingredients for our buns and breads that we sell and these ingredients will buy monthly. So for the machineries, the total cost is 3,300 ringgits. Uh, in, and it consists of two food display warmer that costs RM1200 ringgits, mixer 400 ringgits, and oven 1500 ringgits. For the, for the equipment, it costs up to 570 ringgits, and it consists of utensils, 14 piping bags, 10 pack of tissues, bowls of different sizes. Uh, so that our bakeries can run smoothly and properly. So for the packaging, we use paper bags as our packaging. It's priced at 5 ringgit for 100 pieces. And moving on to the bill, we allocate 500 ringgits for the bill. And also the rent, we allocate 1000 ringgits. And for the minimum wage, for the workers, there is 1,000 ringgit. And to sum up everything, the total cost RM 12,070 ringgit, Malaysia ringgit. So, uh, this is the account for new business. For the first month only, our target is to sell at least 500 breads. Each bread is sold for RM 3 ringgit. And in order to maximize our profit, we will need to set a target for the bread sales with a reasonable price. So actually the bread is priced at in the range of 3 ringgits to 5 ringgits. So for the formula, the total revenue, price charge times quantity sold. So the reason why we put RM4 ringgits here is because it is, it is um, in between and it is more reasonable. Uh, it is in between the 3 ringgit and 5 ringgits and it's more reasonable prices. As I mentioned before, the prices range are from 3 ringgit to 5 ringgits plus RM 36,000 ringgit monthly. So for the profit, total revenue minus implicit cost plus explicit cost. And times 12 months of years and it cost up to RM 8 RM 89,160 yearly. So in conclusion, we must sell at least 300 buns a day to gain a monthly prof to gain a monthly profit of RM 7,430 get from the business. So the previous business. So as I mentioned before, I am the operation manager for. Uh, the baker's bread at Kuala Lumpur and the background. Our first baker's bread branch is located at Pavilion Kuala Lumpur. It has been growing ever since the opening of our bakery. The small business that we set up two and a half years ago is still making a lot of improvements day by day. Our field breads there can sold up to 7,500 ringgit monthly after years of gaining customers trust in that area. And our market planning or our market strategies to gain more profits and to gain more customers. It has been dream our it has been dreamed to open a new branch across Malaysia moderately by opening the second branch at CFS IUM. It motivates us to work harder to achieve our goal and doing our best in delivering the best quality of breads to our customer. Our experience for two and a half years in Kuala Lumpur can be channeled to another branch of Baker's Bread. However, it is never easy to open another business from scratch, especially when it involves money. And because of that, we are hoping for Farahana Corporation leads by Datin Farahana itself to help funding our business. So that's why we really need our funding from the corporation as it never is and it's never been easy for us. 
For the improvements, varieties of Phoenix bread will be added to our new list of menu. This new enhancement are expected to boost our sales there. However, our fine ingredients and techniques will remain the same for the delicious flavors. We also aspire to help the community around by hiring more employees to help the economy financially. So for the varieties of feelings breads, um, it will be based on the customer's demand, customers in the CFS IIM Gambang like the feelings bread, we will increase we will increase the quantities of the filling spread there. So this is the account for previous business. Uh, for the formula, total revenue, price, ch price charge times quantity sold, RM4 ringgit times 250 units times 30 days, and it costs up to 30,000 monthly. For the profit, gain up to 17,160 yearly. So in conclusion, Dr. Farhana should invest RM10,000 on Baker's Bread considering the prospect of our business so that we can carry out our future plans and earn more profit as we hope to increase our sales at CFS IIO and Gamba Campus. So I guess that's all from us. Um, thank you.